Hello and welcome to this video. I'm having the black pieces here in this blitz game against Dubit. Dubitch played him twice. Not won a game. Maybe I get a dirty Harry after d4. Come on, do it. He's reinventing chess now. What about rook g1? Okay. Uh -huh. All of a sudden you can you can play quickly, right? So he went for the Rosolimo instead. Knight c4, okay. Not sure where you're going with that. Knight to c4, knight d2, I mean. That was a Freudian slip. Thinking about a possible plan that could be, no, I have no clue what he's doing. What is he doing here? F4, no, that makes no sense at all. Very strange. Um, Bishop B2, maybe, is that the move he's preparing? Hmm. I wonder if something like A5 takes B5 is an idea, but, but that would only activate him, right? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe he just wants to move back and forth and win on time. This is a very common strategy <laughs> and you're trying to decipher well, what kind of idea does he have? And at the end, there's just no idea. Just wants to make random moves and win on time. It's a very popular strategy, in fact. I'm not saying that this is the case. He has an idea, I think, but uh, sometimes uh, I just spend too much time trying to figure out, okay, what, what on earth is that? And there is just no point. You should just make um, yeah good moves and like reasonable moves and think uh, later, right? Like f3. What what's that? That is really not. What what is that? So I get to e3 and get to play f4 in this position. Yeah. Now I just have to sec on h2 and deliver mate. <laughs> Sounds very simple. Okay, first of all, going to make it more difficult for him to play d4 ever. And then we'll see about potential uh, attacks. It is really dangerous. What is he doing there? I have no clue. Anyway, so g5. And yeah, knight to d4 would be completely devastating somehow, but hard to get. Maybe he wants to play knight c4? I, I don't know. Knight d1. Ah, that is the idea. Okay. Okay, so this one. So my very strong bishop on d4 got traded. That is not, not very nice. How do we, the knight should come to g3, yeah? would be really nice. Like king f7, it's, it's very slow. Like knight g8, f6, and so on. Still try. Okay. Wow. Um, okay. G4 is hanging. This goes there. I wonder if I can actually do that. 
it looks a little bit offside, but this is still going to be an attack. Um, the other one, yeah. I could have, I mean, I meant the other rook here. I could have just taken with the h4 rook. But there could be cases like this where, or maybe knight takes even, yeah? Why not knight takes? And now, I, I need the queen, clearly. But currently a7 is under fire. Okay, Th then he's got rook h3. Let's take this. He cannot play king f1 anyway. I need the queen. Queen h7 is the idea. Not sure that I sh that king e6 was the best idea. Now that the rook is away from the a file. What 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 what, what exactly can he do here? I mean, king uh, queen h7 is going to be really dangerous. And that is very nice way to put it. D4, queen h7, he has one check and that's it. Like queen c4, king d7 and that's it. Okay, so this is going to at least win material. And I'm going to take it. It's just it's just better to to grab the material for I'm trying to find a mate that's not there given the the increment um there's no way in hell that he's defending that so here queen g1 mate it looks like curtains yeah yeah I and mean, there's an amount of weird moves that a position can take and he played uh, many weird moves so like this is fairly normal i think and probably a position where white has a, a small advantage which is kind of confirmed by the engine i think from a structural point of view um white should be um a little bit better here it's not much but then he started to make a series of really uh, weird moves. Knight d2 was the first move that I didn't quite get. And he played knight e2. And um, yeah, I felt, I mean, this is so slow, I should try something. So f5, bishop b2, queen c7, and then that really strange move f3. I mean, what is the, wh why would you go f3? I, I don't know. Okay, the engine wants to play f4, g5, and then attack. Yeah, maybe this is actually better. It's possible, as it is faster. I mean, I spent quite a good amount of time with this, and ultimately the bishop got traded. And um, maybe that is indeed true, that f4 is good for g5, knight g6, and then throw the kitchen sink. Yeah, it, is, it looks dangerous for sure. So we got this, and I mean, it, it, it looks devastating. I just need, <laughs> like, rook takes h2, queen h file mate. I know that it takes a bit of time, but it's it's extremely strong once it hits. So we had this, this, g5, queen e2. Ah, yeah, knight, knight g6. Okay, I mean, my position was not bad. I'm not, I'm not saying that. I just, like, wonder... Okay, so here actually white is better with queen c3. Why? Why? Hmm, okay. I would. Why can I not just play this? Is there a direct problem? And then knight f2.
Hmm. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm sort of willing to believe that white is better. I'm just a little bit shocked by the plus two. I wouldn't have thought that white could be winning here. But maybe um, it's just awful with the rook on h6. It's really possible. I don't get anywhere in terms of an attack. And I cannot move those two pieces. Yeah, that is probably right. Mm. I mean, I, I do know that the engine is right. I mean, you, you, it is rarely wrong <laughs> in any way. And uh, I'm just, sometimes it takes a moment to sink in like, okay, this is really, really terrible. He played this. And uh, wow. I didn't think I was in such a, a problematic position. H3, knight g8. Okay. Yeah, queen c3 then. I totally did not see that move. Queen c3. I don't know. I had a total blind spot. I have no way of even covering the pawn. Remarkable. Man, he played all those instant moves without any any thought, really. Now, um, it's still bad. It's still bad. Yeah, it took a series of really bad, bad decisions by White to get me into a good position. Probably here, right? Uh, okay, the engine finds some way to draw, but then you have to really start thinking at some point. And he just made, in, su in a super critical position, made instant moves. And here it is, it is lost. King e6 is the strongest move, that's funny. And here you just you just win stuff. I did not realize that I was in so much trouble. Hmm. Yeah, it's probably good to be an optimist. Okay guys, thanks for watching.